So Flux isn't just another image model. It's fast, flexible, and it changes the game by unifying generation and editing in one system. You can prompt it with just text, and it generates. You can add an image and use it for editing. Same system, same speed. Now, under the hood, Flux is still a diffusion model, but instead of working with raw pixels, it uses this compressed image version in latent space to keep only the details that matter. The variational encoder and decoder handle this so the model doesn't waste a lot of compute on extra noise. Once in latent space, Flux uses flow matching. Think of random noise as this cloud of points and real images as another point. The model learns a vector field, right? Arrows that guide that noise into structure. Following these arrows step by step turns that randomness into a finished picture. Now, traditional diffusion models needed something like 50 steps. Flux does it in just four. It uses adversarial diffusion distillation, where a teacher model generates slowly, but a student model learns to match it in just a few steps. Another smart part is the conditioning. With only tokens from the text encoder, Flux generates. Add tokens from the encoded input image, and you can use it for editing. Same backbone, handles different inputs. And you know what's coming. Change that four steps down to one step generation. That's gonna give us real-time edits. Looking forward to that.